the National Immigrant Justice Center, NIJC, has put forward a compelling set of 10 proposed actions for the executive branch to improve the immigration system and conditions for immigrants in the United States. These actions, developed with the goal of enhancing the system's efficiency, fairness, and respect for human rights, are seen as crucial steps towards a more just and humane approach to immigration. They believe that the Biden administration should create a task force to coordinate migrant arrival and prioritize quick processing. They also advocate for phasing out detention and expanding legal pathways. These actions align with proposals from other advocacy groups and reflect frustrations with previous administrations' approaches. The calls for action come as Democrats regroup after a failed attempt at bipartisan reform. The NIJC proposes addressing the lack of pathways for undocumented immigrants and the intersection of criminal justice and immigration enforcement. They also suggest improving asylum processing and protecting asylum as a form of humanitarian relief. Implementing these actions would represent a significant shift in the Biden administration's approach to immigration and could mobilize the Democratic coalition. The current immigration system faces several challenges and shortcomings that the proposed actions aim to address. Some of these challenges include Lack of central coordination of the arrival and onboarding of migrants, leading to inefficiencies and delays in processing. Also, immigration detention facilities often face overcrowding and substandard conditions, negatively impacting the well-being and rights of detained individuals. It is no news that the existing system provides limited opportunities for immigrants to legally enter and stay in the United States, leading to irregular migration and reliance on dangerous routes. Asylum seekers face lengthy and complex processes, which can result in prolonged detention or deportation, undermining their access to protection and due process. Additionally, some individuals, including long-term residents with ties to the United States, face deportations due to the lack of affirmative protection measures and limited review processes. Addressing these challenges and shortcomings is crucial to creating a more efficient, humane, and fair immigration system that respects the rights and well-being of immigrants. Consequently, the NIJC proposes a list of 10 actions for the executive branch to improve the immigration system and conditions for immigrants. These actions include Number 1. Create a White House task force to coordinate the arrival and early onboarding of migrants. Number 2. Channel funds and future budget requests towards quick processing of migrants instead of enforcement and detention. Number 3. Phase out immigration detention. Number 4. Expand legal pathways for immigrants. Number 5. Utilize designations and redesignations of temporary protected status. Number 6. Expand parole programs and create new ones. Number 7. Implement regulatory measures to allow people with long standing ties in the United States to seek affirmative protection. Number 8. Improve asylum processing and protect asylum in its present form. Number 9. Review and address deportations. Number 10. Proactively dismantle initiatives like Operation Lone Star and 287G agreements that allow local police to participate in immigration enforcement. While the proposed executive actions represent a significant departure from past approaches, advocates believe that prioritizing order and fairness in the immigration system could help counter political attacks and build momentum towards comprehensive reform. As the Biden administration navigates these complex issues, the implementation of these proposals could signal a shift towards a more compassionate and strategic approach to immigration policy. Thanks for watching.